This is Go Go Hamster Chef, a free-to-play indie game where you grab ingredients from the world around you, bring them home to prepare, then cook, and then deliver the dishes to your neighbours. It's cute and has a nostalgic style, and you get to drive this little moped around the village. It's a simple, short, and fun experience where nothing else of note happens. I completed a speedrun of this game and managed to take the first place on the leaderboards by almost 10 seconds, which was cool, but there was something else left in the game I wanted to have a look at. When you beat the game for the first time, you unlock a mode called Let's Ride. My instinct told me it probably had something to do with the moped, and I was right. You spawn into a racetrack where a simple course and what appear to be some power-ups lie before you. There's a timer and a lap record to keep track of, so naturally, I decided to try it out. Yeah, it's hold, hold forward to go, and uh, yeah. These are speed boosts, but they're not, I don't think they're speed boosts in the way that I expected. Let's just say I spent like well over half an hour doing this uh, previously. It is so fun. It is just insane, the speed you can get. And you can ride the walls in a way where you can maintain speed. But when you get a, when you get a real kind of rally going, uh, you get some speed, you get some mega speed. Oh my goodness. Okay, here we go. I haven't actually been up close to these things. Like an inverted sphere. I believe that these slowly raise the cap of how fast you can travel um, because I think after like three or four of these things you basically just get infinite speed um, sort of like that big rigs over the road racing uh, oversight where you can reverse infinitely which is very fun I was right it is very fun but without spoiling anything or getting ahead of myself these speed boosts will come to be quite useful later on. In other words... That's a surprise tool that can help us later. Oh my god. We're fucking flying. Oh! Okay, so that happens. <laughs> Excuse my outburst. Um, that happens sometimes. Um, you just hit like a wall or something funny. And then you just lose all your uh, all your speed. I don't know what uh, what it is, but I guess I'm trying to beat seven seven point five. I should have recorded it. I really should have just recorded it, regardless of not getting the whole attempt. But that's all right. Okay, I'm gonna use the analog stick for now and see what happens. I tried using the keyboard at one point, and uh, I, I feel like moving the mouse kind of actually helped, like seeing where I was going and. How harsh of an angle it is. I mean, it's a tiny track. It's really not that hard to memorize. When you're going at light speed, it's hard to see coming. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. Oh! <laughs> We're fucking flying, man. We're flying. <laughs> Holy fuck! Holy shit! <laughs> it's like it's like so overstimulating. Like I can't, oh, I can't even fucking fathom what I'm looking at right now. Jesus! We oh, we almost had like a real good peep. Oh, oh. oh I need to get off the bike for a second. Holy fuck, man! Why do I have a simple cell? Wait. Have I had that the whole time? Alright. Let's just add an obstacle to the to the track, I guess. Where did they come from? That was weird. Tingy. Okay. Oh, oh! I feel good. Damn. Oh, thank you for taking my speed again. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, it's so hard to process what's fucking happening, man. I think it's just a matter of just getting around. Oh my god! Oh god, go, go! <laughs> okay, 790, 790. Nice. Oh, are you serious? <laughs> Heaps. 
I'm outside of the track now. <laughs> um, well, I mean, I'm outside of the track now. What do I do with this information? I didn't mean to do this. Uh, what in tarnation is happening? Oh, you respawn. I didn't expect that to happen, to be honest. I'd been driving for about 20 minutes at this point, and my hopes of just getting better at controlling the light speed were dwindling. So I decided to have another look at those enigmatic speed power-ups. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna test a theory of my own, um, in that these are stored. So... I don't think that's the case, to be honest. Before we see the results of my experiment, I just wanted to go over my thinking here. So I'm a big fan of kart racing games, namely Crash Team Racing. And if you're an intermediate to advanced player of the game, you might already know about the boosts and reserve system. Put bluntly, the more boosts you obtain during the race, the longer your top speed is maintained. Sort of like you're grabbing fuel for the kart and burning it over time. So too little boost and your speed drops back to normal. For some reason I was convinced that this was also the case back in Hamster Chef, so I wanted to see if there was a similar system in place. I drove over the same boost power up multiple times instead of just grabbing them along the track, and well, here's what happened. I don't think that is the case, but um... It certainly seems like it. Like I'm getting, I gained like a lot of speed way faster than I normally do. Holy shit. Bro. If that's the case... This might just be insanity, but... There's no way it does. It, like, stores how much you have. There's no way. Let's see how much speed I can get. I don't, I, I would be very surprised, to be honest. Holy fuck. Holy fuck, bro. <laughs> hey, fucking bro. <laughs> no way. <laughs> Holy fuck. Bro, what the fuck is <laughs> Oh my god. What the fuck? <laughs> no fucking way, man. I'm like crying. This is so fucking funny. <laughs> I don't even know what to do. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking throw up. Oh. Okay, let's see if we can go even farther. I knew I wasn't insane. I knew I wasn't. I knew that something funny was happening. Alright, so it's been a couple minutes. <laughs> Just, I, I don't know how many times. I'm trying to do it like once a second, so there's a lot. So let's try it. Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh, fuck, man. It's not counting the laps anymore. <laughs> Nine seconds. I'm pretty sure that was two laps, amigo. But okay. It's not even counting the fucking laps anymore. How's it going, man? How do you feel? How do you feel about this, uh... This blue sacred fire, whatever it is. Oh! Wait, I found it. I got it, I got it. Okay. This might mean lap times are insane. 
Oh, the timer stopped. Why did the timer stop? Does it know I'm out of bounds? No. <laughs> what am I to do in this, in, in this limbo? So there you have it. The game is broken. We not only bent our lap time in half, we also drove so fast that the game forgot how to time our laps. With a new personal best of 4.56, a time basically unbeatable without this insane boost method, I was happy to call it a day. I hope you enjoyed the chaos caused by this little red moped. Please also go and check out Go Go Hamster Chef over on Itch.io. It's free and it looks like a lot of hard work went into it and it certainly feels like it when you play it. So hopefully I'll see you in the next video.